yeah, obviously a big win for you. What was your reaction when it was going to the judges scorecards? They said, Chris, you don't know yeah. which one was you, it's yeah. gonna be. Were you confident that it was gonna go your way or were you not very sure? I, I, I was pretty confident. I thought that I did enough, you know what I mean? Like, it's one of those fights, I mean, I would have been disappointed if it went the other way because I felt like I did have, you know, some positions, especially in the striking. I felt like I was doing more, I, I really did. I mean, he cranked me a few times, but I mean, I just, I felt like I had control of him. I don't know if that makes sense. Maybe something I just felt in the fight. But when they read the scorecards and gave him the 30-27, I was like, oh snap, like this this isn't good, man. <laughs> yeah, how, I mean, how on earth do you justify 30-27 for him? Is, were you perplexed by that one? Because I, I well, couldn't see it that way at I all. Think I, I don't know, man. When it's judging, you're, it's kind of position, too. And my coaches were on the far side, and they were, like, kind of nervous about it, too. And then, because most of the, the action took place on the other side of the ring, so maybe the judges and whatnot were closer and saw a little more than that. I don't know, man. Who knows, right? Yeah. But the, big big win for you, right? So, definitely. I mean, what does this one do for your career? Because Chris is a guy, you know, he's on the ultimate fighter. He was undefeated before. Yeah. It seems like this drop to flyweight hasn't gone, you know, the way he wants, but still a huge win for you. Yeah, definitely a good win against a good guy. I mean, He's super athlete. I, I knew that he was going to be really athletic and that everything that he gave me, I expected. I just, I guess I expected a little bit more out of myself. So there was things that I did uh, good, like the distance and the range, and I was able to land some punches and get a little more comfortable in that element, which I haven't in the past. But, um, you know, everything's a learning experience. So I think getting a win over him is good, but I mean, uh, you know, I wanted to finish them, so I'm a little bit disappointed that I didn't do that for myself. Yeah. But hey, it's a win. What are you looking to improve on after this one? You mentioned, you know, you, you faded a little bit. Is that the thing you're going to look at the most in terms of, you know, technique and the other things, following the game plan? Do you do basically yeah. everything you're looking to do out there? I, yeah, I mean, I think a lot of it too is just getting comfortable um, inside there and, and knowing how to apply the gas and, and the pressure when I need to and back off and, and breathe and just. You know, I think it's just experience, you know what I mean? I mean, the training went really well, exceptionally well. I think I, I burned myself out a couple weeks ago just training too hard um, and had to kind of lay back on the last two weeks of training. So, I mean, in regards to that, maybe I'll just peak myself a little better, but it was a new camp, a new place, new experience. <clears throat> so, you know, it's fine tweaking, right?